Back everybody, our comedian and actor Tracy Morgan is coming to the Mississippi coast. He'll be at the beautiful Beau Rivage Theater tomorrow night. A little bit earlier today, I had a chance to talk to him about his upcoming performance. Hey, I don't even have to introduce this famous face, but I will, because it's my job. Tracy Morgan, ladies and gentlemen. Tracy, how you doing? I'm doing great. How you feel? Oh, great. Fantastic. Top of the world. And you know what? I'm excited because you're coming down to the coast, Beau Rivage, Friday night. What you got in store for folks? Well, it's going to be on fire Friday night. I'm going to be like the New York Knicks. I'm going to be on fire. Oh, we got a little NBA going here. Well, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I will be funny, 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 like I've been for the last 28 years. Well, you funny, know, I want to actually go back, you know, because every, Saturday Night Live, 30 Rock, by the way, one of my favorite all-time TV characters, 30 Rock, countless movies. What was it like when you kind of were coming up in the stand-up comedy world? Well, you got to understand, I never came up. I was, I was here. Uh, I, people, somebody asked me earlier today, when did it start for you? I said it started in 1968 at 525 in the morning when my mother's water broke. <laughs> A natural born comic. I like that. Uh, so what kind of material are you working on today? When people see you, what are some of the subjects you're hitting? Well, I'm talking about everything that happened to me in my life, my experiences, you know, and I can't sum that up in, in five minutes. I mean, I'm talking about everything. I'm talking from relationships to human behavior. And that's what I like to talk about the most, human behavior, because it's hilarious. Yeah. The, way we behave, the way we behave is hilarious. Human beings can be pretty funny, can't they? So, uh, so what, uh, what do you enjoy about the buzz? Because, you know, you make movies. You do, you're doing a lot of voice work now, I know, in animation. Uh, but what's the, what do you enjoy about the buzz of that being on stage? And there's the live audience out there. Me, I, I enjoy it a lot, but the biggest part of it it's not the adulation, it's the work. I enjoy the work the most. I love doing my best. And that's what I love the most. I'm not big on the adulation, but I'm big on the work. Well, that's cool to hear. Because that's the only thing that sticks around when it's all said and done, and there ain't no more else to say or do, is the work that stays. So what's your like schedule these days? I mean, are you touring America? Was this, is this kind of a one-off? At Beau Rivage? I'm on, I'm, I'm on tour right now. I'm about to do another special for HBO Max this month on the 20th. And I've been on tour for that for about a year and a half. Oh, well, I love HBO Max. I'll be watching that. Oh, thank you very much. I, my life is always something new every day, so I'm going to talk about it. I'm going to drag you down a rabbit hole for a second. You don't mind, do you? Sure. I don't mind. What are your thoughts on kind of the controversy surrounding comedians on what they can and they can't say? You know, Chappelle, Chris Rock, whoever you want to pick. I don't believe there's any room for that in show business and comedy. You don't believe there's any room for censorship or being careful? No, no, no. When you're on stage and you're a comedian, that's sacred ground. Well, I like that. Prior and George Garland went through they, what they went through for. So we can say what we feel and want on stage. As long as we're not hurting anyone. Tracy Morgan, coming to Beau Rivage to light it up. Thanks for being with us. Thank you for having me and God bless you.